remember the alternate circuit breaker was popped on a PCP, and so we can't uh, so we can't use the alternate uh, actuator at all. I don't think. Right. So if, if A were to be blank, we'd still be go, providing B's in control. Yeah. And if B was okay. Yeah. If B happened to be in control for some strange reason, and the uh, and the B one was blank. Still be go providing A was in control and A was okay. Yeah. Well, the thrust that, of that, that is that if you only have one, it has to be in control. Yeah. To be go. Yeah. And, and now before we start into the PPNC, where do we stand on the data? Uh, we've got that problem. Uh, we've got PPC, MBM, whatever. So we cannot like send the state vector across. But I can send commands. You can send the CIU. Yeah. I can't, can't send the, right the data through the. Right. Uh, FM. Um, and we have, oh, they fixed that. The SCU 80, they fixed. I don't know how they did that, but it's fixed now. So we're back on sales one. So, yeah, we don't have any real constraints right now. Yeah, I don't have data right From us. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, I don't have any data right now. Yeah. 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 data take three and four he's going to do an IMU align we, I guess we should tell him we don't want to align IMU three I mean it's failed he may not but we definitely don't want to that that IMU the way it is at does give us some insight into some specific things hey Franklin uh, we were just wondering we wanted to s keep up with you could you give us a status on where you are in the EVA prep yeah we're just starting uh, on page uh, five dash four of the uh, checklist okay thank you EVA flight, did that help? Yeah, uh, that's not real good news. That puts them, and that could put them as much as 40 minutes behind the timeline. Uh, the worst thing that happens to us here is that if we are indeed a half hour behind, it means, and we're, no, and we're not successful on 18A, that they're going to get outside a half an hour earlier, uh, later. What, what that I mean, means, it, flight, is that we do not we do not have a 21A available to us if we press on with this because of the batteries. What that means is the IUS will not be able, we will not be able to get off a deploy on time. But that's, that's, we're, we may be stacking, stacking some failures here, flight. That assumes that we elevated and we st stuck after umbilical pull which is a much shorter EVA. So we might be able to say that the EVA had to, to go up to 29 degrees. There's a little bit of a trade yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Clock doesn't start till we go on batteries. I mean, they're True statement. Right, okay. We try on 18A, if it doesn't work, we do an EVA on 20A. Isn't yeah. that what the plan is? Yeah, but I guess what they wanted was for you guys to be ready to egress the airlock. For the 18A. But if we don't get an elevator on 18A, then we're going to have to well, go to the 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, we're going to use that, uh, that uh, cap timeline up to uh, whatever time it is, 2340 or something like that, right, Mike? And if we get it elevated okay to 58, then we're going to we're going to jump to that other page of the cap for the deploy. Yes, sir. Okay, and if we don't get it elevated, we're going to stay in that one that we're in the original one, and the deploy will be later than 18A, I presume. And that calls for, for airlock depress on the cue card at about uh, 10 minutes into day one. And the uh, supports that for a few minutes. Okay, let me walk out and talk to Lonnie and see what the, where we are. Make sense. The failure here is a small leak in the uh, water coming into the uh, water tanks in the, in the mice. Which, uh, so it sounds like 
out of the connector, it might not even be a fit problem. It might be a connector problem. Yeah. Well, we'll see what happens. We'll see what they, what they tell us to do, but it's a small leak. So, uh, basically, you, look, you saw it. Yeah, because you're facing me, and it's right here on my uh, SCU. Oh, coming out of your SCU? Yeah, right, uh, right over here. There's a, little, there's a little bubble in the uh, lower right corner of the SCU. There's a little water bubble for it. looks like we're a little bit behind. If we get behind about as much as 90 minutes, we may have to slip some of our other activities. So if you could keep us uh, informed on where you are, and we're trying to figure out uh, how much we have fallen behind. Okay, we'll keep you updated. Okay, thanks. So you, we're about 40 minutes behind right now, is that what you're saying? Atlantis. Go ahead, Atlantis. Okay, I've got the books out and I'm ready to copy whenever you're ready to uh, talk to me. Okay, Shannon, it's uh, fairly easy on the, uh, in the contingency EVA checklist, uh, we want to change step three. You read where it says steps one through three, we want to make it one and three. Do not do step two which is transferring uh, IUS to internal power. Okay, I'll copy that. Copy that. Uh, no power in the uh, power position or back in battery, and we'll take a look at that and get back to you, Don. We show 2245, maneuver to deploy attitude. Yes, sir. We should have the deploy pad to you in just a few minutes. Well, okay. Wait, we're about a, few a minutes, minute, it's uh, three minutes LOA. away. We're about a minute LOA. Although they tell me we have UHF, which surprises me. In flight photo? Yes. We should, we'd like to get a checkpoint this LOS if we could. Well, okay, let's talk about pads. The timeline shows them starting to maneuver to deploy attitude in three minutes. Okay, we'll come out a little three for CP31, CP32, or. Okay. Three, two, one. Four. Mark. That's a good read, Banks. Okay, I got motion over here. Okay, we're going to release your bill. Okay, I'm going to take the umbilical, mark nice, primary enabled, to enable. Okay, I got my gray top back. You should get a uh, decom pill. I'm going to take the release to release. It's falling okay. away. Great, okay. The IUS bus A, batteries, I mean alternates. Decom pill. Okay, I got four. Do we have the uh, two asterisks for umbilical check? Yes. Okay. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, 
Good, and we're going to 70 degrees. Pitch right's good. Yeah, it's going right over top of us. Beautiful. There's the moon. Good play on time here. It's Houston and the uh, IUS and Galileo are on our way. Roger, congratulations. Copy GNC, thank you. Less than half a degree errors and less than 200th of a degree per second rate. Thank you.